They say that they 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 you're gonna die young. Die young. That's why I think that you should have fun when you're young. Cause time won't wait for no one. Uh -huh. When God calls, you gotta go home. Go home. But they say that they're gonna die young. Die young. That's why I know that we gon' have fun uh -huh. in this life. Cause you only get one. Yeah. When God calls for me, don't yeah. cry. Just I'm sure that home. everybody's heard. Their mama said me days like this. Now this is a story I could not tell in church. James is a special boy, interesting. As a small child, as being an uncle, I roughhouse with kids. And I always end up, you know, hurting them somehow, I give them cookies or something like that. It's like, don't cry, I'll give you a cookie. But James, no, not so much. All I had to do is say the words, booby. And he'd light up. And he'd stop crying. I mean, I don't, I mean, four, five, six. My name is Josh Rosenberg. Um, James, I just want to say thank you for my baby show last two months ago. I'm glad you uh, made the point to come out. Okay, so that was the play. Oh, is it recording? Oh, yeah. <laughs> here. I bet you remember this team. Back in 2003, you were my third baseman. You were my practical joker. You were the player that always told me what to do as a coach and then I would say, James, just get back at third base because I'm the coach and you're the player and you eventually listened to me. All right? And as a team, we came together and this trophy right here represents a 2003 Mid-Maryland championship, and you were part of that team. You were an integral part of the team. You pitched for me. You played a strong third baseman, and I needed that. I needed somebody to you know, stop that ball at third base. So I miss you, buddy. Think thanks for all the great memories. Love you. It's just a video. There's nothing much to say. This is how we gonna got money. We're gonna live on, keep doing this car business, and keep this keep this dream alive to make it the system the loudest it could possibly be.
Cool. We were doing a family picture, all six kids, that were all six deaf and nieces on a couch. Everybody's smiling, everybody's having fun, except for James. He's crying, he's grumpy, he's agitated. He is not partaking. Trying to get this shot off is near impossible, and he's not cooperating. I try to, you know, say movies, that didn't work. I try to, you know, try to be nice, try to get him cooking, try to do anything, and he's not responding. So I tell him to, or I, I, I say to him underneath my breath, really lightly, I say, James, fuck you. And he stopped, he looked at me, he looked over his mom, and he started giggling. And he looked at his mom and said, hey, I'm the teenager, so fuck you. <laughs> And he lit up, took the picture, done. So, James, God bless you. James, this is for you. We love you. I knew my little brother so dope. And mom and daddy wanted to move our bro. I did it. I still got a lot to prove and show. I just wish we ain't had to lose blood through the struggle. Because you know, they say that the good die young.